thanks to all of you, and now it's on to Chicago, and let's win there. The alleged assassin, Sirhan Sirhan, was wrestled away by police. Sirhan Sirhan was arrested that night and tried for murder. He got the death penalty, but California's death penalty was ruled unconstitutional in 1972. The sentence was changed to life in prison. I don't even know that, that the man is dead right. myself, so right. I, I, if there is any conspiracy, I'm completely unaware of it. In 1975, the parole board ruled that Sirhan should be free in 1984. Larry Trapp is arguing against Sirhan's release. We cannot permit political assassination to become a way of life in this society. We've seen what it's done in other countries. Sirhan Sirhan was again asking to be released from his life sentence for shooting Robert Kennedy in 1968. He was to be freed in September 1984, but that date has been rescinded. Sirhan said he considered the death just another homicide and that the board was not considering his case fairly, but asking him to renounce his political views. If we go on this case as a straight homicide without consideration of the identity of the victim, then I, I feel that I eminently qualified to be paroled and all. But the panel once again decided against Sirhan, saying only that he is not suitable for parole. Sirhan's request for parole was rejected for a tenth time. The California Parole Board said Sirhan is still a danger to society. For his part, Sirhan said he now believes he did not kill Kennedy in 1968. L.A. Deputy District Attorney Thomas Trapp called Sir Han's denial preposterous, mind-boggling, and insulting to the American people. I, I was, I, obviously I was there, but uh, I don't remember the exact moment. I don't remember pulling my gun uh, out of my body or whatever it was located, and I don't remember aiming it at any human being. Now, there are growing calls for a new investigation. Kennedy's son, Robert Kennedy Jr., telling the Washington Post he met the man convicted of the crime, Sirhan Sirhan, in prison and left disturbed that the wrong person might have been convicted in the killing of my father. Sirhan Sirhan was stabbed this afternoon at Donovan Prison in the South Bay. Sirhan Sirhan was taken to a San Diego hospital to be treated for the stabbing injuries inflicted by another inmate. The 75-year-old man has been in custody for more than 50 years since Kennedy's assassination back in 1968. Today, in a stunning decision, the parole board recommended the gunman be released from prison, something few had predicted. There will be a 90-day review before the decision lands on the governor's desk when RFK's killer could become a free man.